Well, how's it going, guys? It's, you know, it's usual. And, you know, something probably dropped. Like, this thing fell. I was charging my, trying to charge my phone. I hit my, right here, eye directly on it. It just fell. Like that, with all my Star Wars characters on there. If you didn't know what was on there. But, uh, I'm bringing you another YouTube video today. Today's video is gonna be, you know, kinda, you know, out of nowhere type of video. Like, like crazy type of video. But, like... I, I told you I've been taking this one class. We like this one class for TV or something. Like, uh, it's been helping me a little bit, just a little bit, but like not all the way sometimes. But as I was bringing, as I was saying, um, here's gonna here's a story on what happened today at school. School, you know, school. I don't really like school between you and me, guys. I I just like it. You know, I just like it, but I have to go. I only got like two more years. I'm a I'm a junior, by the way. I'm gonna I'm gonna be a senior next year, so I'm so lucky. And today the nurse like I went I felt sick, I ate some like uncooked dough by accident because some part of it wasn't was uncooked and I made it too and I did a lot of other stuff. And I made it and then I ate it and then like after that I felt sick and then I ate my lunch for a little bit. The nurse said I had, the nurse, I told her I didn't feel so good. And I didn't, like, she said, oh, I have nausea. I was like, every time I go down there, keep saying I have nausea. I don't even have nausea. I felt, my throat was killing me. I didn't feel so good. I felt sick to my stomach. Like, freaking horrible. And, you know, like, when Jim, when I, after that, I went to math class all fine and stuff. And I did my work. And I went to gym and had to run a mile. Like, like that smile my legs felt my freaking right here all right here felt tight as hell like there was a chain over it tight as tight as tight and i felt sick to my stomach there i was like really sick to my stomach when i was done with it and i'm still feeling a little sick right now i'm still feeling a little sick and a little sick like i'm gonna draw up my insides are killing me i fell asleep as soon as i got home and i had homework to do i forgot like from the last day and my teacher wanted me to do it but I forgot it because I was focusing on all that homework. And plus, I was swimming yesterday, and I felt really tired after that. You know, I got a lot of stuff to do. And there's a lot of stuff, to, you know, I have to do. And so, as I was saying, I, when, after P7 period rolled on, I kept on coughing and coughing. And I got water twice. The second time I was fine. I was, and then the no, <coughs> first time, I was fine. The second time, I wasn't fine. But I drew up in the water fountain. Like, I upchucked right in the water fountain. Like, like, uh, like we have floors in my school. We, I just upchucked, like, on a third floor of my school water fountain. I didn't tell anyone. You know, I flat out didn't tell anyone I did. Like, I kept to myself. Like, I upchucked there. I didn't feel so good. I was like, Ugh. Now I feel like, you know, I don't know. I'm still going to school tomorrow, guys. It's Friday. So that sucks. And, you know. Between you and me, I really don't want to go to school tomorrow, like, flat out, like, but I'm forced to probably, and I don't even know what's going on tomorrow. So, I am i don't know if I'm going to miss or not, because I feel sick, but I won't be, I won't be able to go out, so I have to go, because I want to go out after school. So, as I was saying, guys, um, huh, what am I going to do, what am I going to do? So, as I was saying, guys, I, that's it, and that was it, mostly for that like so after that i went to like my other class like my radio like now now i mean my tv class we just did around like shots and stuff and i had a partner and you know to just be honest and like i had a cool partner she's pretty cool she's a sophomore it, it's nine to it's nine to uh 12. you could have had that class you and she was pretty cool in herself, like, you know, I was her partner, and she was my partner. She's a pretty cool girl. And, you know, she's blonde. I sort of like her. Like, she could be she could be a cool friend, but I sort of like her, like her, just sort of. And, you know, I don't know, like, oh, I'm going to get a new girlfriend anytime soon. No, I'm just going to wait. You know, I don't want to rush into it that much, especially with another sophomore, because I dated a sophomore girl. It didn't end well. 
I went back to her and back to her. That's for another story. That's like probably for the next video. And you know, like I really opened my eyes. Like we were with cameras, and she got she got really close to me. And after that, I got really close to her. That's all because we had to go uh, really creepy close ups with cameras and stuff. She just reminded me of someone. When I didn't like, when I just saw her blonde hair and face like this and this, she just reminded me of someone. She reminded me of my friend that's on her phone, looking at her phone every 24 seven, like going like this. It's like, girl, you're always on your phone. You're not paying attention to the person that's talking to you half of the time. But no, she's she's not doing that anymore, my friend, like flat out. But as I was saying, you know, I probably look a little sick on here probably too, but like I still feel a little sick and stuff and I you know, I still have the little the depression. A little bit of it. But I I control it sometimes. I control it and I work with it and I have to work with it, you know. Like I know someday it would not be there anymore and someday I would probably get what I needed, what I want, what I actually would want, and what I, you know, like, someone says, like, oh, you have everything, you know, there's something that I don't have, and I want it, someday I might have it, someday I might not have it, someday, someday I might have something similar to it, but someday, or I won't have it at all, so, life is a disappointment, man, like, one minute you want this, next minute you want that, but, you know, what you want doesn't want you for some reason. What you what you want doesn't want you, don't want you at all. What you want is probably confused, probably saying this and that, probably saying this, relying on someone else to make their own decisions. Or probably, you know, what's it called, going on with something. As I was saying, um... There's a question I want for you guys that you should answer in the comment section. This is a question that you should answer. Okay, okay, I have I struggled through this. Like it's gonna be like almost last. It's just gonna be a question of the day for you type of thing, guys. And it's gonna be this. And I know, oh, why are you doing freaking questions? You freaking idiot and stuff. Someone's gonna probably say in the comment section, or someone's gonna probably just like it. But you know, okay, let's let's start with the question. If you were in a terrible relationship, and stuff at first it was good it was terrible then in between it started getting good again and then started getting in the middle and you didn't know what to do you didn't know anything your friends telling you you're all your friends are telling you to leave this person but you're not listening because you say you love them and stuff and but you're also miserable and stressed out about it and depressed about it. Like you're depressed about something else, but you're excusing it, making it not like that. And but some when someone brings up something similar to that, they think you're talking about that. Like like stuff like that. And actually like like I've been asking this question to a lot of people. They're saying like I w they would leave that person. They would flat out leave that person. They feel unhappy. Even if it's not about them, they would just flat out leave that person. And I know I would leave that. I would leave the person like that. I left the person like that. Practically, like there was this girl I felt on. Like there was this one girl a long time ago I dated, and I felt unhappy. Like it wasn't her. It was just me. I just felt unhappy and un, you know, miserable and depressed. Like I just felt that way. And I told her it's not your fault that I feel this way. She kept on blaming herself, blaming herself, and blaming herself. I told her I need time to think for myself. I need this. One day we'll get back together. We never got back together. So like, look me now. Like, I got with a girl that's really horrible. <laughs> and then I broke up. We broke up. Uh, like, gone. But you know, she was that girl wasn't really that horrible. At first she wasn't horrible. Then she kept on then. Got it getting horrible, then stop getting horrible, then getting horrible again, stop getting horrible. You know, I was on her butt every time. Like, literally and figuratively, I knew what she was doing at all times, and I flat out did. Because I couldn't trust her. Flat out, I couldn't trust her. You know, flat out couldn't trust her. Essie, I was on her butt. Essie, she was on her butt. Her butt was Essie on my crotch, on my freaking privates. So, most of the time. That's 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 another that's another story. But like, what would you do 
my phone's going off. What would you do in that situation? Would you leave the person or would you stay with the person to hold out and then you could regret something for the rest of your life and be miserable? Or would you get rid of something else in your life? Like an item, a person, or would you do something else? Would you freaking like, you know, risk your life to do something, risk your life to try that or try a new or try a new thing and a new thing doesn't work for you. But as I was saying, that's the question of the day. Question tomorrow a question of tomorrow, you know, we're gonna start doing these questions of the day. And they're gonna be about different topics, different topics I find out. So I'm gonna ask people that question all day. So see you guys later and bye.